Good morning. I hope everyone is well. It's Rachel here and we are doing what's in my box. It's an early morning video. It's kind of dark outside, so no sun shining in. So I am, I do have my light on just in case there are shadows. So we're just going to start um, working on what's in my box. These should really go in there as well. Actually, those ones can go. They're just sort of plain. Oh, all sticking together. Um, I had another postcard somewhere. These I will finish off later. Oh, so many ambitious. Okay, put those over here. And we are going to work on this. Now, I'm thinking, it's just popping into my head now, I might do a little bit of stamping. What colour do I have here? I've got green. Let's do green. I was thinking red. But they, it's green. I have another one here. Oh, there's the red. Um, so where is my nice, here it is. I want to put this, oh, you know, I've got um, Christmas stamps. Where are they? Okay, just one second. these ones that I was gifted um, some vouchers and I I would I used them to buy these very expensive Tim Holtz ones and I think I might stamp something one of those on there oh, that would be lovely I'm just wondering I think I might like a little bit of um, paper I'm gonna do red aren't I so I need something red and nothing too dark um, oh, this one maybe I'll use that let's see I just want a little piece of paper to add a bit of interest Oh yes, that'll work. The grids can't match up, but that's okay. We will survive. Because you know, these are kind of very new looking. I got them at Daiso, I think in Australia. Um, yeah, they're very new looking, but um, they're still nice little journaling spots. I love that. Now, I just want to see, I want to get a nice trim. Now, I did reorganize, oh gosh. <laughs> I did reorganize myself and now I'm struggling to find things. Here's my trim box, I'm making a mess now. But anyway, I can tidy up afterwards. I've got my trim box here. Um, I have little pieces of trim in here the right color I was thinking something like that or this one with the this one here with the stars let's do it that way in there I think I'm just going to tie it it's quite thick you know what I think I should reinforce that because it's not the thickest 
um, piece of paper. Let's just clean that one off. Oh, I know, I might grab. Um, these sorts of things. Here we go, I wanted one of these. Um, maybe, or this one, maybe this one. Then I'll repunch the hole. Yeah. And it just adds a little bit extra on there. With the big one. Probably put a hole in a different spot. It's not quite as big as the other hole, but anyway. What I wanted to do was just tie it like that. Okay, cute. Put those back over there so I don't not tempted to cut paper with them. that was simple they'd be nice tag like tags to put on um, on gifts okay put those up where will I put those over there and let's see what else we're going to do have a sip of coffee it's that time of the morning Mm. Okay, I want to finish this one off. Oh, and there's another one. I'm going to do another one of those. Oh, there's lots of them. Okay, so first of all, I need to put some plainish paper on the back. Let's see if I've got anything here. No, that's not big enough. No, they're really all scraps in there so oh gosh the struggle is real um Okay, 
Oh, I think these should be classed as um, things to finish as well. Just double checking. Yeah, I think I'll use that one. Okay. So. Let me move that ruler. Let's put that up there. Oh, a bit slow today. seeing how sticky it is. Okay. It's a bit sticky over there, so let's fold that. That one's been glued on many times. And we can embellish this one. Okay, let's see what we have. I love this scent. I think, oh, I love that. Okay. I think I might have done one like this before because I do really like it and just put a little bit of green. Love that. Now, let me think. Do I want to add a trim? It's such a fray trim, this one. You're supposed to, like, you can pull see that ridge in there you can pull it and it and it um ruches it gathers do I want that color or do I want green maybe I like the green look at that look at the frame on there let's trim that off green I may as well just use it all on there I think I'm going to put some glue just to hold it in place because then I'm going to staple it. Yeah, love that. Look at those together, aren't they gorgeous? Just love them. Okay, let's do another one of these. Um, okay, throw that out. While I have that piece of paper there, I may as well finish using it. So I'm gonna add that, like the last one. And 
we will do another red stamp but a different one so where did I put them over here I like the fact that they don't fit on there perfectly that they sort of come off the sides in fact I'm not even going to bother putting ink on the sides there not perfect but it will do the job and again I'm going to put this one over the hole just wiggled it around to make sure um, that just to make sure that I've got ink on my finger um, you know it cut out because it's a bit wet I'm looking for a thinner um, oh this one this will do that's a slightly thinner softer trim than the other one I used. I think this one I may staple because I don't, like if I tie it, because I don't tie a knot, I just do one tie. It's not the type of um, trim that will hold. Does that make sense? It's slippery. So if you only do one tie, I don't think it'll hold, it'll open up. So I'm just going to go like this. And there we go. Stapled. Okay, next. We've done those. A couple of those. We'll leave those. Let's do this. I'm just going to grab my paper scraps and see what will fit on there. Right. First of all, I'm going to take this edge off. And that edge. And I don't mind seeing the um, the paper behind. Okay, now I think that tag looks crooked to me, so where's my cutter? I'm gonna just double check. Yes, very crooked. That's 
espera. Let's make it a tag shape. And I'll do it properly by flipping over the corner and doing it on the other side. I could actually, there's another way. I've never done it before. But that's not, there we go, that's better. Whilst I have this here, I'm going to put that, not that it needs reinforcing, but it's just a nice touch to break up the floral bit. Okay, and I think I'm, I'm thinking, oh, I could add, oh, I like that. I think I'm just going to add that there. Did I just use my fabric scissors? This is what I mean. I don't even think I... Did I? I think I might have. You are probably saying to me, don't do it. And I did it. I've moved them, so I won't pick them up. I absolutely love that tag. There we go. Okay, I'll punch a hole in it later. Okay, what's next? It's another plain tag, we might as well do that one. he's been flying around for a little while I'm just going to cut that off I'm going to sneeze <coughs> excuse me I'm very sorry okay right I'm actually going to wrap that around. Don't tell me another one's coming. Oh, I just wanted to do it here. Maybe, maybe I've, got, I've got all these cards here. They are usually, maybe this one, for spreading um, so if I go like this I can put the card there and then trim your corner, your, yeah, your edge. Just flip it over. There we go. And you get a nice tag shape. And you could do this one. I could do even a more slopey sort of one for a different shape tag. 
Yeah. Because you just flip it over and do, do the other side. Because there's no way I would be cutting that. If I wanted to have that and then slide it over there, I'll never get that the same as that. So I just think if you go like that and then flip it over, then it's just as easy. No, it's actually, I think it's better. Okay, I'm sorry, I've got the sniffles now. Just grab a tissue. And wipe my nose. That's sniffling. I'm very sorry. Um, now, I did find that I have this here. Okay. Okay. I like the back. Let's see what all these. Okay. Well, maybe one side we could put some paper for writing. Maybe a bit. I think I would prefer it a bit taller. I've never worked on one of these before, I don't think. So that's on that side and then this side I don't want to cover all of that up but what I could do is maybe grab or some sort of embellishing thing or a label and do a wrap around let's just cut this out and see my drawer is totally depleting there's less and less stuff in there every week which is good I could do that or I'm still feeling like it's a little bit plain I could thinking over here something like one of these maybe I'm just going to try a few to see which one I like the best.
just cut this one out. I can't tell which one I would like to use more if I don't cut them out because I need to see how much they cover. Okay, so this is a possibility. It is very plain, isn't it? I don't want to cover all of that up. Okay, I think I might this one um, but I feel like it needs something else and unfortunately I feel like it needs what about over there and then I can put something over here these are hard I find these difficult that's why I avoid them um, something like that what about oops not those kind of, well I didn't mind that one actually um could do a wrap around no I think I like that one okay good Decided. when you're not wanting to cover too much up right there and then maybe if we add a trim going to take the wire out
Yes, that makes it more festive. Okay, so I'm just going to put some glue here. Well, that was a struggle. Great. Now I like it. That's better. Okay. I don't think I'll do another one of those today. Let's make a pocket. Oh wait, I'll decorate it first and then we'll do that. So, oh, the papers, the papers again. Or oh, I have this piece. I think I'll put that maybe there and that behind it. Yeah, that was quick. So, just tear this bit off here. I'm sticking to the paper. Okay, I don't feel like that really needs too much more. Um, no, I think I'll leave it. What's this little? Oh no, that's the same one. Yeah, okay, I'm going to leave that. Unless. No. Okay, yep, leaving it. No, no Santa. No, okay. Just to be sure. So this is what we've made today. We did all Christmas. Um, those are really hard. This one. That journal card. And then the stamped ones. Love those. And that Santa. So that's my video for today. My what's in my box. So thank you so much for watching. And I will see you again soon. Have a great day. Bye.